Hey y'all, we got our first, uh, actually our second doe is going into labor. This is Capers. So we're very excited to see her, these kids. She didn't give us any last year um, because she went into early labor way too early and lost the baby or babies. We never did see them all. Uh, the dogs kind of cleaned up the mess. Um, but anyway, this is very exciting, so let's take a look. All right, you guys, so now we're going to go out and see Capers. She's um, isolating herself, which is a really good sign that she's in labor. Um, I did see her doing a lot of stretching. She's walking a little funny because she's um, a little bit sore. Um, I'm going to try not to bother her. She's a little bit of a skittish goat. But she's hiding out here, which is good. It's in the sunshine. Here she is. So we're going to stay over here and let her do everything on her own. Zara's going to hang out, I think. But we're going to hang out with Capers right here and not bother her too much. I think we're about ready. So it's been about four and a half hours that I've been out here with this girl. Um, she's been having some heavy contractions. And I just saw her do a couple of pushes. And I saw a little sign of goo. So I think she's just about ready to start pushing out a baby. I think 
think she was waiting for that next contraction. All right, here we go. Couple of pushes there. start pushing pretty heavy here in just a minute I'm sure. <clears throat> I think she's waiting for the baby to start moving through the birth canal. Another contraction. It's a good one. Okay, her water just broke. So next we should start seeing the kids. Good job, capers. another good contraction. <clears throat> you can see how she's arching her rear. Her legs are straight in the back. This will be our first wrecker, babies. I hope we get at least a girl. Here comes our first baby. So unfortunately, while she was pushing, I did not get it on camera, but she accidentally touched her nose to the electric wire. Poor girl. So she didn't want to be out there anymore. So she came to the courtyard, and then Hopscotch was beating her up, so I had to... I'm sitting in the doorway of the barn, blocking Hopscotch from coming in here. But she's finally comfortable. She started pushing again. So hopefully things will get back on track. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to go in there yet so you guys can see it be born because hopscotch is lingering over my shoulder. I will show you. Hold on. There's hopscotch. <laughs> She's being very silly, aren't you? And you want to know what's going on with capers. So as soon as Hopscotch leaves, and Capers is more comfortable, I will get it closer. See something pop up. Good girl. Let's see if I can squeeze. 
we go down here, there's a head and a leg. There's Hopscotch being a turd. There's our first baby. Hopscotch, get. Go on. Out. Good job. Yeah, you have one. Now let's get that nose clean. Yeah. It's all covered. Yeah, look. You have a baby. Move some of this out of here. There you go. Look at that gorgeous thing, huh? Just like mom. It's already trying to stand and it's not even all the way out of the womb yet. Okay, Bruce, why don't you stand up, silly girl? Huh? Stand up so you can get over there. That's a pretty good sized baby. There you go. Good girl. There. It's a pretty big baby. Looks just like ya. Well, it's a big old boy. She definitely still has an, at least another in there. Her belly's still pretty big. So we're just waiting. All right, she just started pushing again. Everybody pray for a girl. <laughs> Keep pushing, it's okay. He's not going anywhere. He's not going anywhere. He's fine. He's right here. Keep pushing. Oh, come on. Oh, there's a foot. Uh-oh. You guys can see that, the way it's facing there coming out breech. So I'm going to keep an eye on her, but I see both feet. So hopefully she can do it on her own. Kikos are supposed to be some of the hardiest breeds and usually don't need any help. So we're going to see how she does, but he is coming out backwards. He or she. Hopefully a she. Alright, girl, lay down. And the sack has already popped, so she's only got about five minutes to get it out before it starts to suffocate. Back legs are hanging out. Here we go. Come on, Mom, quit getting distracted. Come on, we gotta push it out. Come on, Mom. Just push it out while you're standing up, silly girl. I'm just going to put a little bit of pressure on the leg. Only because I, I just worry that it's going to suffocate in there if she waits too long. Here you go, good girl. I'm not even doing nothing. There you go. There you go, Mom. Good girl. There, you got two babies. Good job.
it's a girl! Yay! Got what I wanted. Good job. Good job, Mama. Yeah, let's get all that stringy goo off her face. Here we go. Good job, Mom. Look how cute they are. They're starting to try to nurse. Hopscotch, why are you being so mean? Goodness, leave her a bee. All right, you guys, well, that was some major excitement. We got another buck and a doe, and uh, so thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.